I was popping. It's your boy, Big Rich, Queens, New York City, where we get busy. Happy Valentine's Day to all the beautiful couples out there. Love is in the air, as well as some fat Nelson OG. I just blessed the atmosphere. Ladies and gentlemen, come on in. The streets are still dirty, so wipe your feet on the rug. Throw some smoke in the air and bless the atmosphere. It's time for Indraget, the weekly news. You know how we get down. Let's get right into business. Of course, coming right out of AboutTheMafia.com, Mr. Santolo, that is my go-to guy. Quick, easy business. Let's get right into it. Albanian gangs taking power in Italy after huge mafia busts. Now, you know they got the maxi trial going on. They got, what, over 400 uh, defendants. They're trying to break the pockets of the Indragata, and the Albanian gangs are moving in. You know my motto, the streets gotta eat. That's how it is. Gangs originating from Albania are allegedly taking advantage of the recent mafia crackdown in Italy, which is putting hundreds of associates on trial. Albanian organized crime has had a fairly large presence in Italy since the 1990s but they are reportedly increasing their power as the country takes aim at its indigenous mafia families. The biggest anti-mafia trial since the 1980s is focused on the Andragata, one of Europe's most powerful families. The trial is currently underway in southern Calabria, which is also a main headquarters for the Andragata. The Albanians, and let me say salute to Church Avenue Dan right now, salute to you sir, Some people call him the Albanian Leonardo DiCaprio, but that's what I hear on the streets. The Albanians are reportedly already responsible for supplying Italy with an estimated 3 billion euros worth of cannabis every year. Salute to you guys. Police state that the Adriatic route is used to traffic a significant portion of Class A drugs to Europe. Crime experts warn that these Albanian gangs will see this mafia group crack down as an opportunity to expand their jurisdiction and operations with the goal of becoming Italy's primary crime force. The streets may start popping off again. Let's see. Allegedly, allegedly, they already hold a firm grip on Rome and Milan and are now extending their influence in southern Italy. Disputes between rival Albanian gangs have led to murders and attacks across Italy as groups scramble to seize the power vacuum left by the dismantled mafia clans. With a recent high-profile shooting near Rome attributed to the crime wars. Well, this is a story that I'm going to be paying close attention to, first of all. Because it ties into the Andragata, it ties into the Maxi trials, and now if you got Albanian gangs coming in, There's going to be a fight for the streets, so shit may already be popping off, and we don't know about it. But I'll tell you this much. You're going to hear about it on Indrak at the Weekly News. It's your boy, Big Rich. Of course, salute to Mr. Santolo, AboutTheMafia.com. For the latest news on the Mafia, visit AboutTheMafia.com. NWN, Big Rich, Queens, New York City. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Tell a friend to tell a friend, and let me know what you're smoking on. And we'll talk soon. Salute.